I have a Samsung Galaxy Tab S7 here. I'm gonna show you how to wipe cache partition. Very, very simple. So the first thing that we have to do is turn off or shut off your tab here. If you tap on, if you press and hold the power button and the volume down, press and hold the same time and don't let go until the power off menu here pops up and we can go ahead and turn this off right now. So let's go ahead and power off. Now, once it's off, the next thing we want to do is this. What we want to do is press and hold the power button and volume up. Press and hold. Do not let go until we are actually in the Android recovery menu. So let's do it together. Power button, volume up. Ready? One, two, three. Press and hold. Do not let go until we are actually in the Android recovery menu. I'm still holding on both buttons. I'm not going to let go. Still holding. Here we are. Android recovery. You can go ahead and let go of both buttons. Now, if we look... On here, we just have to go down to where it says white cache partition. You can use the volume rockers to move up or down. We need to go down. So we're going to go down, 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 down to white cache partition. To select it, you want to go ahead and tap on the power button. So let's tap on the power button right now. And then this basically tells you this cannot be undone. You can go no, or if you want to proceed, we're going to go down to yes. So we're going to go with yes. We're going to go down. Highlight yes right there. And now we're gonna go ahead to select it. You wanna press on the power button and look at the bottom here. As soon as I press on this power button, it should be super quick. Let's go ahead and tap it. And right away, cache wipe is complete. So you're done. And then from here, you can just go ahead and uh, it's uh, back to reboot system now. That's highlighted. Just click on the power button to restart it. And you just wiped your cache partition. It's always good to wipe the cache partition uh, every month or every few months, it can drain your battery, it can slow down your tab, it can, it can cause all kinds of issues. And it's only temporary files that you're basically uh, deleting. So that's how you do it. Pretty simple. Any questions, comment below.